Welcome to Baseball News Club. My name is Chris. Today we'll be highlighting the American League top nine MVP candidates from 2019. Let's get started. Ranked at number ninth is Nelson Cruz of the Minnesota Twins. 2019 was his 15th year in the league. He only had 62 vote points. And this is attributed to playing full time as a designated hitter. And that's reflected in his 4.4 war. But he only played 120 games and he had a monster season across the board. He's a fantastic, respected veteran throughout the league. And let us know in the comments if you think he is Hall of Fame worthy. Ranked at number 8 is Mookie Betts of the Boston Red Sox. He had himself a really solid season, but only got 67 votes, which was kind of surprising. I thought he'd be higher in the MVP voting. He had 215 combined runs in RBIs, a 6.9 war. He had played all three positions in the outfield and was ranked 5th in on-base percentage. Ranked at number 7 is George Springer of the Houston Astros. He only received 69 votes. He played 122 ball games, so he didn't really put up monster numbers, but was impressive as he was ranked 4th in the American League and slugging percentage. I think if he had played at least 150 games, he would have been higher in the MVP voting. He was on his way to have a 45-50 to 50, uh, home run season for sure and at least 320-plus total bases. And ranked at number 6 for MVP voting was Matt Chapman of the Oakland Athletics. He had a solid season, received 89 votes for MVP. I think the theme that hurt him was the high strikeouts, low batting average, on-base percentage of just 342, and he only had a combined runs and RBIs of 193. But his 8.3 war was ranked 3rd out of all the MVPs, and this former first-round pick is still only three years into the league, so a lot more exciting baseball to come from him. Ranked at number five is Xander Bogarts of the Boston Red Sox. He's a steady player, but he upped his power numbers in 2019. He received 147 vote points, and his offensive numbers were pretty impressive. 33 home runs, 52 doubles, 190 hits. He had a combined 227 runs in RBIs and a 5.9 war. And then with his 341 total bases, that's just a lot of hitting. Coming in at fourth is DJ LeMayu of the New York Yankees. His three-time Gold Glove winner received 178 vote points. He's a former LSU Tiger, 26 home runs, 197 hits in 145 games. Very impressive. In between the lines while he was hitting first pitches, he was hitting 462. And another impressive stat was anytime he received two strikes on him, he was able to be a very efficient hitter with two strikes, and he had a 389 runners in scoring position average. Very impressive season for DJ. Then coming in ranked at number three for the MVP voting was Marcus Simeons of the Oakland Athletics. Now he received 228 vote points for the MVP honor. He hit 33 home runs on the season, had a solid second half compared to the first half. He's a former University of Berkeley ball player. He had a average in runners in scoring position of around 327. However, with two outs and runners in scoring position, he only batted 278. This was definitely a breakout season for him with the 343 total bases. That is a lot of total bases. Now, coming in at number two on the list is Alex Bregman of the Houston Astros. He had a very solid season and actually received 335 vote points. His offensive numbers were pretty strong. This former LSU Tiger and first round pick was very tough against left handed pitchers on the road. He hit better than at home. He hit 315 on the road. He was impressive with two strikes, so he's stingy, hard to get out, 9.1 war. And his on base percentage was a 423 on base percentage. That's very impressive. And his combined runs and RBIs, 234. Very nice season. And before we reveal the number one player, I'm sure you know who it is. If you could please subscribe, turn on your notifications, follow us on Instagram and Twitter. We really appreciate your support. And let's move on to the number one selection for the American League MVP. And coming ranked at number one for the American League MVP of 2019 was Mike Trout of the Los Angeles Angels. He received 355 vote points to receive the MVP honor. He had a career high 45 home runs and that was only playing 134 game. He's a former first round pick, product out of New Jersey, and he hit first pitches, 477 average, and an 8.2 war. He hit a little bit better on the road at home, um, and overall he was batting 297 with runners in scoring position. 
He led the American League in on base percentage, slugging, and OPS. And what's scary is that this guy actually played 155 or 150 plus games. He would have put up some pretty monster numbers. This is his third MVP honor and just a great season for Mike. And we hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching Baseball News Club. Have yourself a great day.